On this dive, I found two giant female lobster that were both carrying eggs, and I want to share the life story of lobster reproduction and the incredible odds they face to reach such an impressive size. This dive was filmed on August 7th on an unharbored beach south of Boston, and was in about 15 to 20 feet of water. Here the sea floor is mostly gravel bottom, with a few large boulders scattered around, which harbored many crustaceans and other fish species. I believe this individual is a common winter skate, but I am not positive, so please weigh in in the comments. This is the moment I spot the first female lobster, who had dug herself a shallow den under a large boulder. Likely several months ago, this lobster molted and in her softened state, mated with a male lobster to fertilize the eggs she carried inside her body. She then found a safe place to lay her eggs, where they will remain attached to spinnerets on the underside of her tail for up to 9 to 12 months until they are ready to hatch. From these eggs hatch mosquito larvae sized larval lobster, which live a free floating planktonic life until large enough to sink and reside on the seafloor. A one pound female may carry as many as 8,000 eggs, so these five plus pound lobsters likely have over 30,000 eggs. Older, highly reproductive females like this are crucial for the success of the population, and females carrying eggs must be released unharmed. On commercial lobster boats, these individuals are marked with a V-notch in its tail to signify that that individual can never be harvested by anyone. After one final look, I release her right back into her original den where she can continue raising her eggs. This is the moment I spot the second large lobster in a similar shallow dug den under a large boulder. It takes about seven years for a lobster to reach one pound in legal harvest size. Lobster age can be estimated by multiplying weight by four, so these individuals are likely over 30 years old. It is estimated only one out of 25,000 eggs will survive to become legal harvest size. I needed two hands to hold on to this individual, and even though I didn't harvest any lobsters this dive, I still enjoyed finding such impressive specimen. So next time you sit down for a lobster dinner, you should appreciate the incredible odds they overcame to survive and end up on your plate. If you enjoyed this video, please consider liking and subscribing, and check out my website for more content. Thanks for watching and you'll hear from me soon.